African countries can do better in uh, uh, contributing to preventing outbreaks because Africa is one of the epicenter of emerging zoonosis uh, diseases, uh, including Ebola. And African countries uh, need to commit themselves to the activity of preparing their countries, building the capacities, national capacities, to prepare better to prevent these emerging epidemics. And when I mean prepared better, I mean to move from the attitude of waiting for an outbreak to happen and then mobilizing resources, mobilizing capacities to respond to it, to anticipating outbreaks, therefore building the capacities, surveillance systems, detection systems, risk uh, measuring systems, to anticipate these outbreaks and to be able to identify, find the earliest signal of an imminent outbreak and prevent that outbreak at source. And that requires strong government commitment, political commitment, but that commitment should be followed by investing in preparedness and response activities. There is very little investment in preparedness activities. Most government prepare and invest in response, uh, in medical activities. But that preparedness is so important because it's that the, the, the area which gives you the capacity to prevent an outbreak at source and prevent the huge human suffering and economical devastation that outbreaks can, can, can bring forth. So uh, they need to commit but following the commitment, actually invest, and invest enough. Uh, own the coordination mechanisms, multi-sector coordination, and lead, take leadership uh, in having sectors collaborating together to prepare better their capacities, their laboratories uh, for any outbreaks, and implement those uh, 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 plans. Following that, they must be able also to measure then how they are performing using those plans and improve those plans as we move ahead.